My name is Roy Chitwood, developer of the track selling system and president of Max Axe International. I'd like to personally welcome you to our track selling system workshop. Some of you are probably wondering why you're going through a sales training program. You say you already know how to sell. Some of you do. Maybe you've been selling for 5, 10, 20 years or longer. However, that doesn't mean you cannot be more effective. We're going to show you how. Now let's look at the fourth ingredient in your pyramid of success. Method. Method is a game plan for selling your product or service. It's knowing how to match your product or service to a customer's needs. Method is a precise step-by-step -step procedure that covers all the points in the selling process and leaves nothing to chance. Combine method with interest, attitude, and energy and you're at the top of the pyramid with success. Method makes you a sales professional. It helps you remember and complete all the little details that make the difference between victory and defeat. Business conditions have changed from a seller's marketplace to a buyer's marketplace. Competition today is greater than ever. To be successful, a salesperson has to be a highly trained, competent professional. A salesperson has to be honest with a genuine desire to serve the customer. When selling becomes a procedure, it ceases to be a problem. If it's not a procedure, it'll always be a problem. Max Sachs International has developed a proven sales procedure called the track selling system. This method will help you close more sales without pressure and build long-term customer relationships. If you'll learn and master the science of selling it will guarantee your future sales success. The track selling system consists of seven steps. Approach, qualification, agreement on need, sell the company, fill the need, act of commitment, and cement the sale. Track selling is not a can procedure, but rather a structured process that allows each of you to use your individual personality and adapt it to every selling situation. For example, these seven steps might take place in one call or they might occur over several weeks or months. In this module, we'll cover the first step in our track selling system, approach. Experience shows that much of your success in closing a sale depends on how well you perform in the first two steps of the track selling system, approach and qualification. The technique to get the results you want is the track selling system. And the reason is because track selling is based on the science of selling. However, before we discuss the first step in the procedure, there's something that you need to understand about each and every sales situation. The prospect always has a hidden agenda. I call it hidden because most prospects don't even know they have one. The agenda is that most prospects will make five buying decisions in a precise psychological order before they're willing to buy. The first decision is about you, the salesperson. Prospects will decide if you have integrity and good judgment. They also make decisions about your company, your product or service, your price, and they decide if this is the time to buy. To qualify a prospect, you not only have to determine if there's a need, you also have to determine who has the authority to buy and if the prospect has the money to buy. To find these answers, you need to ask the right questions. Prospects buy for emotional reasons, whatever the product or service. There are six primary emotional reasons that we refer to as the six buying motives. Desire for gain, fear of loss, comfort and convenience, security and protection, pride of ownership, satisfaction of emotion. To obtain the information they need, they use two types of questions, fact-finding and feeling-finding. Your fact-finding and feeling-finding questions should be phrased in three different ways, as open-ended, reflective, or directive questions. About 75% of the sale is determined by how well you perform in the first two steps, approach and qualification. If the prospect likes you, trusts you, and feels that you understand his or her needs and wants, closing the sale should be the logical conclusion 
to a well-given presentation. In the last module, you learned about the agreement on need, sell the company, and fill the need steps in the track selling system. Now you're ready to close the sale, or as we say in track selling, obtain an act of commitment. Yet the biggest problem most salespeople say they have is closing the sale. My many years in the marketplace have taught me that if salespeople would close only one time, their productivity would jump by 50% or more. Research shows that 62% of the time, when a salesperson should be asking for an order, he or she is not even attempting to close the sale. The track selling system enables you to close a sale smoothly without pressure. If you run into objections, the system allows you to take up the challenge and try to close again so that you can obtain a commitment to buy. We call it our partnership agreement. Remember, as a sales professional, if your prospect doesn't have a need, you have no right to sell. On the other hand, if there is a need, then you have a responsibility to fill that need and help solve the problem. The act of commitment is not the end of a sale. It is the opportunity to begin a long-term relationship and a new cycle of business. Sales is the only company activity that brings in the dollars. Your success and that of your company depends on one thing, how well you sell. The following are the results of a study conducted by Pepperdine University in Southern California of 1,500 graduates of the track selling system. More than 60% of our graduates experience a sales dollar increase of 25% or more after attending our program. Six out of every 10 of the participants after completion of the program made the sale they developed and practiced in the workshop. This means their company got an immediate return on their investment in this training. More than 90% of the participants rated the track selling system better than any other sales training program they have ever taken. Success is never a matter of luck, background, or magic. It happens because you make it happen with your commitment, training, and self-discipline. The rewards are there for you regardless of your age, sex, and experience. Develop your skills, set your sights high, and go for it. You can do it, it's up to you. I wish you good selling, good fortune, and may God bless you abundantly.